Take a little hiatus for a couple of seconds. We're going to talk to Dan Colco about another national undergoing Tommy John surgery. Man alive. But you talk about tough news for Aaron Barrett. He also is on the list of guys that had the Tommy John. Yeah, it's mm. an ever-growing list. I know, Daddy, unfortunately, I know. it's just kind of a something that's happening throughout Major League Baseball, and the Nationals have had their fair share of guys with Tommy John as well. Aaron Barrett becomes one of them. Had that procedure a couple days ago. Showed up to the Nationals clubhouse yesterday in very good spirits. Uh, said that it wasn't just the Tommy John surgery that he had, but they also removed a handful of bone chips in his right elbow and also shaved down a bone spur. So there was a good amount of work for the surgeons to do on that right elbow. But Barrett's remaining optimistic. He says there's a chance that he could be back in late September next year. If not, then he's back in 2017 hopefully fully healthy. Matt Williams talked about the prognosis for Barrett, the short-term recovery, and how Barrett's motion might have contributed to this injury. It's a lot of strain on everything when you throw that hard and break those breaking balls off like he does. So, uh, yeah, there was a lot of a lot of uh, loose bodies in there that they were able to get out and uh, and and fix it up. And you know, he's anxious to get to his therapy and and into his rehab and get back as quickly as possible. So, I think he's in good spirits uh, and he's ready to go. Steven Strasburg, Dan, against the Marlins had to leave that game August 30th. The back tightened up again with the series of the Mets just around the corner beginning tomorrow. Will he be in the rotation tomorrow, Tuesday, or Wednesday? That's the plan is for him to pitch on Wednesday. He had a bullpen session today here at Nationals Park, and the Nats are going to monitor Strasburg and see how he came out of that session in the bullpen. The good thing that they have here is that Tanner Roark is lined up, and he could slot into the rotation for them if Strasburg is not able to go. Strasburg had his last start skipped. They hope that this rest and the medication that they gave him will allow that back tightness to kind of calm down and that he'll be able to go on Wednesday against the Mets. But the good news is Tanner Roark's ready if they need him. Tanner's set for five days from now, if need be. If um, if that's not the case, then we'll adjust and and uh, he'll he'll you know pitch when he, we need him to pitch. And they need Ryan Zimmerman to keep on hitting, although he will not hit today. He is not in the lineup against the Atlanta Braves. He's been the hottest hitter on the club since he came off the DL outside of Bryce Harper. Why a scratch for Zimmerman today? Maybe hottest hitter on the planet. I was gonna say, yeah. This guy's been yeah. fantastic the last exactly. couple of weeks. Now, Zimmerman had that plantar fasciitis issue, which landed him on the DL for a little while earlier this season. It's not something that he's totally over now. He feels better, but the plantar fasciitis doesn't just go away. So Zimmerman Zimmerman is still kind of monitoring this. He's still dealing with it on somewhat of a daily basis. There's some days that it's good for him, some days that it's not. And yesterday we, we saw him maybe limping as he moved into second base one of those times. The Nationals are opting to give him the day off today. They say it's just a day off, even though he was in the lineup initially. They want to give him this break. They've got these three games coming up against the Mets. They want Huge. to make sure Ryan Zimmerman is as fully healthy as possible for this massive series against the team that they're chasing. So just a day off, the Nationals say, they want to get Zim rested and ready to go tomorrow when the Mets roll. A good, day. smart move. Wouldn't you agree? I agree, yeah. I mean, hopefully yeah. you'd like him in the lineup any day yeah. you can get him. Exactly. All the games are pretty much must-wins at this point, but you really want to have Zimmerman fresh for the Mets. Thank you. Thanks for coming out here and joining us, the little people out here on the old concourse. We any appreciate it. Any time I get to spend with you, Johnny, <laughs> is a win for me.